dear brothers, dear sisters, uh, in this Sunday, we're in the week of the Christian unity. It's a very important week that comes every year. But you might tell yourself, how am I going to do something for unity when we are uh, separated from each other? But we know, we know that uh, when we turn together to God, whether we can be near each other or not, uh, God himself uh, gathers us together. So in this time of this Sunday, let us take the time to turn to God, towards God. Bless the Lord, my soul. Bless the Lord, my soul. May I, our soul bless the Lord. And if, if each one of us, there are billions of Christians on the earth, if this Sunday, billions of Christians turns toward God and blessing the Lord, Lord, I bless you. Lord, I open my heart to you. So he gathers us together He's uh, because he's our God. Uh, in the end, there's only one way, the, be the deepest way to get near to each other or to gather with each other is to go through God. Because when we get nearer to God, we get nearer to each other. So in this Sunday uh, where we pray for Christian unity, let us take the time, a couple of minutes, to put ourselves in front of God and bless and blessing God uh, in thanksgiving for uh, all his gifts, everything, his love, his life that he wants to share with us. Let us to our turn towards Jesus Christ who's our Savior, opening our heart to the gift of the Holy Spirit and uh, blessing God the Father, the Eternal Father, so that opening our heart to God, we open our heart to each other. When we take the time to pray to God, uh, whether we're alone or with others, when we take the time to pray to God, it not only changes, deepens our look towards God, but it also enriches our way to look at each other and to see each other as brothers and sisters in Christ. That's our identity, that's our reality, that's our gift, the gift of unity by being brothers and sisters in Christ. Bless the Lord, my soul.